I just bought Tekken 8 today and I am looking forward to it. The first Tekken game I got was Tekken 2 back on the PlayStation. This was when I was like eight years old or something like that. Back then, the character I played the most was this character called Jun Kazama, or Kazama Jun as Japanese would call it. The reason I picked her is because, well, two things. First, she has the same name as me. Yes, Paul is my English name, but Jun is a shortened form of my Korean name, and my family calls me Jun. So on the battle screen when it says Jun versus Jack, or some Jun versus Law, or something like that, I'd feel more connected with the characters. Like, I even the game even says my name. And the second reason I like Jun Kazama is because I just learned a few moves that I could spam again and again, and they were just pretty long strings of moves. So I had fun spamming those few combos again and again, and that was how I played the game back then. And then I got Tekken 3, the next installment, which was great. It was a fantastic game. Great music, by the way. I think a lot of people appreciate that the music in Tekken 3 was so good. <laughs> But that's where they introduced Jin Kazama, and this is the tattoo that he has in Tekken 3. Now, I already made a video about why I got this tattoo, how I got this tattoo. It's actually a kind of an embarrassing story for me. Since I already talked about it in another video, I'm not going to talk about it here. Just know that these Tekken characters like Kazama Jin, Kazama Jun, they've had a special place in my heart since I was a little boy. It's funny because as much as I play Tekken 2 and Tekken 3 a lot, I did not play Tekken 4, 5, and 6. Tekken 7 is when I got back into it, and to be honest, I'm such a spammer, like, I didn't learn the intricate details of how to play this very well. I don't even know how to juggle and all that. And the funny thing is, Tekken 7, people said the story mode was the worst part, but the reason I bought Tekken 7, other than playing it with my friends once in a while, was for the story mode. And that's pretty much why I got this game as well. The new game just came out today, Tekken 8, and I am looking forward to the story. I don't know if I'll heavily get into the gameplay and start trying to learn combos for different characters and all that, but this game has so much nostalgia for me, I want to see what happens. It's funny because I was told from one of my friends that I have to have my arm a lot more buff like Kazama Jin in order to have the tattoo look good. There's no way I'm gonna get as buff as him. Like he's, you can't see his arms here, but he's super buff, like steroid level. But if I can just get it a little beefier, I think I'd be happy with that. By the way, the reason I'm excited about Tekken 8 is partly because Kazama Jun, my main character from Tekken 2, has been absent from the series since Tekken 3, and this is her first time back in the story mode. This is her right there. I mean, she's made some cameos in the non-chronicle game versions, but I'm looking forward to finding out why she's been absent and what she's been doing over all these decades. Anyways, that was a little backstory about why I love Tekken. I'm looking forward to playing it. Oh, and also since I worked out this morning, 1% better every day, baby. Today is the fifth day in a row that I'm working out. Leg day today, step ups as slowly as possible. Let's do this. <sighs> So that was seven minutes on each leg, 14 minutes total. Oh man, those leg failures are quite painful. Anyways, mission accomplished. Machi. Kitty. <laughs> Mochi. So cute. Just a little bit after that last point with Djokovic. Look at that one. That's the one that I would have loved to have seen Clayton back in the 16s. So soft Mickelson's and warm. Tigger. Well, I mean, Paul had matched. Yeah. Lost yeah. a couple. Yeah. Mickelson lost to this guy. This is straight. And the gap was pretty evident in that match. Mickelson young. Tigger falling asleep on my crutch <laughs> Mochi came next to me on the couch no I spoke too soon maybe she's gonna leave soon Oh,
Mochi cutie, Mochi cutie. And your shaved belly. Poor Mochi, it'll grow back. It'll grow back, Mochi.